Hi guys, you can see this is Windows Anniversary Edition, <coughs> Windows 10. So if you want to go to the factory reset, you just have to go to setting. You have to go to the update and security here. Click on it, this recovery. And you have to go to get restart for the get factory reset settings of Windows Drive C. You just click on it and then remove everything. Don't keep my file, remove everything. So when you get remove everything, they will ask you the hard drive, which drive, drive C, all drive. If you do all drive, you don't have to do. You have to do only the drive where Windows is installed. So click on it and then remove file and clean everything. So they will ask you, okay, click on it. This, you have to click on it. So when you click and remove files and it might take a few hours. So it will be factory reset and your everything will be clean and done you can see here that's the main thing so after your windows will be clean and reset and all your files will be gone and it's just like a factory reset of windows 10 so here is windows 10 anniversary edition factory factory reset or you can say just like a reset the windows only drive C not D because D will be your backup that's all so you just have to say you can read all personal files and blah 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 and then just have to reset here and then just boom everything is done hi guys I'm just going to reset my computer so here's the reset option in the setting so just choose the recovery and there is a three options so i just reset the pc only one partition and now restarting the pc so i want to just clean all everything i just back up already from my picture my document my my videos everything so now i'm just going to restore clean window so this is windows 10 anniversary edition so that's all nothing special so just want to share small video so how to reset the windows 10 anniversary edition just go to the setting here from setting you go to the recovery recovery there's option reset the pc choose get re get started so from there it's just restarting everything as a factory like a clean everything but there's option they ask you you want to choose drive all or only drive have windows so you have to choose only the drive have windows so that's the best way so anyway now it's just restarting and soon the window Just getting restart just be patience always some people they have a difficulty after they upgrade the windows and they have problem with the windows so I just want to make some video that people they have a difficulty after upgrade stuck some software have problem so how you can do it you just reset your window and all remove all the softwares install just use the softwares you really use it don't just uh, download the softwares and see it takes a little bit time you have to be patient don't have to worry so just within two minutes and it's just preparing I think it will take a little bit time clean up everything and just install the new windows not stall actually it's just cleaning the all program or junk so it's just make the windows on the factory reset kind of so have to be patient a little bit don't have to worry sometimes the screen you can't see but it takes time sometimes
so here is the starting one person So you don't have to worry, you can see sometimes stuck in 1%, 95%, 98%, don't have to worry, just let it go, that's all. So here is now 8%, so still resetting. Nine person. So now it's almost eighty percent. Around thirty minutes, more than thirty minutes it takes. Here is a clock. It's night two ten. Okay, oh yeah, so this is the screen after everything is done. So just want to change it from here. Uh, let's see, just I think US English and here is okay. Just do it next. Here is next. And then you can see here is uh, update accept. And then skip this step. And then customize. I recommend you go to customize is the best. You can just stop some kind of hidden apps that takes data. So just turn it off is the best way if you want to on later you can on but don't let the app take behind uh, a lot of stuff that you might don't browse protection update smart screen off off this to download off I just I just off everything because it's better I recommend your windows will be faster and hidden things will not run so now it's just going to the procedure So you can write it. Lenovo. Okay. Just Lenovo. Next. Just not now. 
I don't want to use it. So here's just starting again. This is some kind of new screens you can see, never seen before. So after anniversary update, I just reset my PC to the factory mode, like a factory reset. So just want to show what's happened. Everything is smooth and clean. My drive D is just like that. Only the drive C is just clean up everything. Here is your start, everything here. Display setting. Actually, the uh, auto drivers is stalled here. So. just stall the all stuff here let me see the windows version here okay about so yeah this is 14393 you can see uh, anniversary so that's all I'm just doing some adjustment and everything is done smoothly and so far you can see here uh, my computer drive C is just empty very clean drive D my all backup is here so This is all backup for drive D and drive C is just empty. Everything is my picture document is all clean up. So anyway, thanks for watch and see you in the next video. Bye bye. Uh, one thing more I want to show you here, yeah, apps feature. There is a lot of apps here. So default apps, mm, choose, um, apps and feature.
multitasking, personalize is a privacy. Yeah, if you go to privacy, just close many things here by default is sometimes is on so let the camera off this kind of stuff and store microphone Microsoft account H OK off and so many things there's a behind running apps you have to on is better otherwise it takes account information and picture off so I just mostly off all many most of the things so it's take less resources and you can see here behind so most of the thing you can turn off if you think you don't want to use so it will optimize your windows anyway see you bye bye